Can you make a subscribe to the man from Cheap Seats? View from the Cheap Seats! Cheap Seats! Yeah! <laughs> Sunday afternoon, Lakeland, Florida. Super kick party starts right now. Well, maybe not right now. Let's get some food first. Friends Market, who are we gonna find here? What a random, what a random occurrence to run into you here. Of all places. I've never seen one of these signs. Today, gun show and wrestling. Dinner was good. Now it's time to yell a little bit. Get a little bit of super kick party going on. Wow, it's crazy running into you here too. All right, we're just everywhere. So I thought this was the line to get in. And by the way, the NRA, not part of Ring of Honor. They're here for the gun show. Uh, but this is the line to get in. And it goes on and on and on. Behind this woman over here, I assure you, Colt Cabana is over there signing autographs for charity. Money going to Puerto Rico. There was a corner of his head. All kinds of people milling around here now for Colt Cabana. He's still blocked. He's around, whoa. This is the line to snake around all the way over there. It's me, Matt and Nick from the Young Bucks. This is a television taping for Ring of Honor. Very small. You see this boom camera is actually not in our way this time, which is a great thing. The last time that we were here at the JP Morgan Financing Arena was for Supercar of Honor in April. Much smaller this time than the last time that we were here. We have t-shirts over here. Perhaps this line is to get the Frankie Kazarian t-shirt, which I see at the end there. They put the most popular shirts right here. These are our shirt offerings from Ring of Honor. Based on those two, based on all these shirts, those would be the ones I'd want to um, Sean is doing reconnaissance now to figure out exactly what are these lines for. I see Cody Rhodes, or just Cody rather, all the way over there. Like no longer roads. One half an hour later. This is the line shaping up. We're almost at the cashier. This is the line for Bullet Club. And this line behind us are folks trying to pay to get into this line. Wow. Sean, one quick question. Doink the Clown. Bullet Club or not Bullet Club? Uh, not Doink. Complete Bullet Club. It, it has to be Bullet Club. Sean agrees. I agree. We, will, we also met Sean. Sean uh, has a podcast. Top yeah. Rope podcast. Yep. Doink? Bullet Club, Club or non Bullet Club? Uh, mostly Bullet Club. Mostly. Black and white clown you colors. Would, you know what? That would be amazing. So Doink would come out and instead of like. So you would have the Gordy <laughs> Scroll like umbrella yeah. that shoots water. Um, you could have balloons. Balloons. Bullet Club balloons. What if he had the balloons, right? Yeah, yeah. Bullet Club balloons would work. But they'll have to be like it, you know, the Tim Curry one where they'll come down from the ceiling <laughs> and then they'll pop on people's faces, but it'll just leave like a black mark across everybody's face. That'd be funny. So Doink right. is Bullet Club. That would work. That would work. I'm, I'm already sold. I'm already sold. <laughs> Where's Matt Ford? Now line and timing is getting crazy. The Young Bucks are over here. They've got their own line split off. The rest of the Bullet Club's over here. I'm kind of torn because I want to meet Kenny Omega. And his line is kind of long. You don't get to him in time. You don't get to use your ticket. You don't get your money back. But we've got to choose between these two. And we've got Sean kind of going to hold my spot for the Bucks. Sean is up there talking to the Bucks. He's friends with them. We've kind of switched spots here now so that Sean can try to get Omega or stay online while I wait online for the Bucks. We're finally here. We're finally ready. What's up, man? Super kick party. Ready for some We are ready. How you doing, man? So while we were waiting in line, we had a question. Yeah, sure. If Doink the Clown was alive, Bullet Club or no? Oh, man. <laughs> He's better than 
bone soldier, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, why not? Why not? Could he weave like the black and white clown makeup? Yeah, we can make him really like scary looking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's better than some current members, so yes. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Then we can have the fake Doink the Clown, like that we do with Sing. Uh, that'd be a thing. <laughs> it's absolutely it. Doink the Clown. He's elite! Oh, he is. Oh, yeah. The show is starting in 17 minutes. Here's our spot. Sean played Pseudo Kyle. Trying to get uh, you know I, I was Kenny Omega the cameraman for me from the Chief Seas, which is pretty cool. So you'll see that footage <laughs> a little bit later. I, I kind of wanted to get to say the smash subscribe yeah, button, but uh, no, we didn't go that route. <laughs> I'm gonna go into convulsions now. Sean's gonna find me laying on the floor. You survived! Oh, that's gonna be loud. One, two, three, go! Bullet club time. What are the odds of that happening?
with the streamers. Oh my god! I'm pretty sure he flipped them over. He's right on the ground. Christmas presents. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. In spirit. Tacticing taking over the merch stand. I'm not really sure what's happening here. There's a giant mob scene over here for the kingdom. Flip, where is he? Oh, he's just hiding in the corner over there. So just in case Mary is watching this, when I come home with an umbrella, you're going to know why. I, I had nothing to do with it. It's hard. But he needed it. It's a green umbrella and it has a hook on it. Look, I, I mean, it has a hook on it. You know? <laughs> I get to get under this and, you know, pull things down. We're trying to teach people in the audience. Too sweet. Oh, oh my God! Yes! Yes! We broke the too sweet cherry. <laughs> ah! The crowd is dead. <laughs> Everyone is waiting for full club. <laughs> Nap time. Oh, oh my oh, God! Right in there. Right in there. Oh, oh, what a stiff elbow! You have to appreciate Ring of Honor. This rope right here. It's not straight. It's very much like if you were a kid drawing the ocean. Didn't that guy used to be in black and white? 
in between segments, we've now watched three guys By the way, set still up this table. table. They're working hard. Come on! You can do it! Just Cody, no roads. They're doing a contract signing for a final battle, which they announced as a seminal event. It can't be a seminal event if it's the final battle. Which is it? Got a big pop for ring crew tonight.
So once again, for each and every one of you that follow what I do in my home promotion, New Japan Pro Wrestling, thank you very much. I hope each and every one of you can tune in on January 4th. But until then, I still have San Antonio. Guess what? Sold out. Guys, I'm going to appear as much as I can for Ring of Honor Wrestling, and I hope that you're not going to support them. But you support every single wrestler that tries to change the game up a bit and make this industry a little more interesting. <laughs> and so I must bid you all adieu. Funding arena. I'm getting out of here if I can find the car. Well, I'm back home from Ring of Honor. That was a really super fun night and day out with Sean. We'll put a link down to his channel again in the description below. Awesome time seeing the television tapings for Ring of Honor. Awesome getting to meet the Young Bucks. Talk to them a little bit uh, with some tomfoolery around uh, Doink the Clowner for those that don't know and don't follow wrestling. Um, the reason why we were talking about doing so much, he's been a recurring theme in this channel for a long time. Um, mostly because he, uh, at least the main person that played Doink to begin with, no longer with us for many years now. And uh, we just recycle and put random people into that character because he was a clown, can wear the makeup. Anyway, it's kind of bad explanation to that kind of poor joke. But also awesome seeing Kenny Omega. So for those that don't know and don't follow wrestling, um, WWE, obviously the big kid on the block for many, many years, always the big kid or could be the big bully. Um, Ring of Honor exists as, you know, kind of like this um, collection of independent wrestlers. Kenny Omega, champion, New Japan Wrestling, um, is slated January 4th to meet Chris Jericho, who has been the, one of the biggest company men for the WWE for the last 20 years or so. Um, and they're going to meet in New Japan um, for their pay-per-view January 4th. Um, Wrestle Kingdom, I think. Probably I, I may have butchered that, butchered that a little bit. But in any event, um, going to be super awesome. It's great to see people from the WWE um, taking risks or people that are, are kind of earning that money or, the, you know, achieving, achieving that fame. I'm going back to doing what they love to do instead of being part of the machine, uh, which is what Chris Jericho is doing by facing Kenny Omega in New Japan. So super awesome on that stuff. I'd love to see other people be able to walk away and do things that they really love instead of doing things that pay the bills. Um, and it was really great to just get back to wrestling overall. We haven't been to a wrestling show in a while. And I think the reason is we usually would go to NXT shows. NXT at Full Sail tapings, very, very difficult to get um, tickets to at this point. But more so, um, NXT used to run like shows every month in Orlando. And if you missed the Orlando show, you'd be able to go out to Melbourne and check out the show there. Or you'd be able to check out these other shows that used to play everywhere. Like Fairgrounds in Volusia County or Lake County and these little small things. They don't do that anymore. Like NXT has become more of this like third brand entity for um, the WWE and very, very difficult to catch the shows that they do locally. So, um, you know, there's been times that I've wanted to go and it's conflicted with other things. So very happy to see everybody that was there for Ring of Honor. Awesome night. So on that note, enough rambling. Thank you very much for coming along with us. And thank you for all of your likes and your comments and your subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. We'll see you guys.
Hey, can you make a subscribe to the man from Cheap Seats? View from the Cheap Seats! View from the Cheap Seats! Yeah! yeah. <laughs>